What do you need? Welcome to the cozy little family. Why don't you take a look at some of my merchandise and we'll see what kind of deal we can make. Until next time. Always a pleasure, boss. What could I do for you? Always a pleasure, boss. What could I do for you? Don't like those eyes you got. Some may call this jump. Mm -hmm. Even if you're one of us, you better not make trouble. Hmm. It's good to see you in one piece lot. I just wanted to give you a proper thank you for everything you've done. The guild is back on its feet again, and on its way to a prosperous future. What's become of the skeleton key? That's it then. After all those years of helplessly watching the guild decline. But enough of that. I'm confident that with you in charge, we'll soon have more gold than we could possibly spend. I'll be down here, trying to coordinate everything with Delvin and Vex, to make sure the coin keeps flowing, and no one skims. If you still feel like doing some jobs, I'm sure Delvin and Vex have more than their fair share to give out. Either way, it's been a pleasure, my friend. Here's to the future of the guild. May it last another thousand years. Sorry, lad. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Something for just about everybody in here. Imp, take a look. Do come back. A few gold to spend, please. All right, thanks.
northern maiden is ship shape. If you're looking for go. passage to Solstein, too bad. I'm not going back there anymore. It's hard to explain. I remember those people with the masks coming on board. Then, the next thing I remember, I was here, and they were gone. And that's not right, losing whole days like that. There's been something strange going on there for a while. But after this, I'm done. I'm not going back to Solstein. Have you been listening to me? I'm not going back there. Hold on now. I'm just a simple sailor. I never wanted to get mixed up in any of this. All right, I'll take you. But we leave immediately. Well, here we are. This is Raven Rock. Can't say I'm all that glad to see it again. Good luck. Maybe you can figure out what's going on around here. So I'll assume this is your first visit to Ravenrock, Outlander. State your intentions. Mirak, I... I'm not sure. What did I do? Just remember, Ravenrock is sovereign territory of House Rhetoric. This is Morrowind, not Skyrim. While you're here, you will be expected to abide by our laws. Any questions? I... I'm unsure. I swear I know the name, but I cannot face it. I don't think so. I'm not... The, the name has something to do with the Earthstone. I'm not sure what. Jolan, I was starting to wonder what happened. We, uh... We were delayed by bad weather. Before you even asked... don't seem to be in quite the same state as the others here. Very interesting. <coughs> May I ask what it is you're doing here? Mirak, Mirak. It sounds familiar, and yet I can't quite place... Oh, wait, I recall. But that makes very little sense. Mirak's been dead for thousands of years. I'm not sure, but it is fascinating, isn't it? Perhaps it has some relation to what's going on here. Quite unexpected. I'm afraid I can't give you any answers, but there are ruins of an ancient temple of Mirax toward the center of the island. If I were you, I'd look there. That's that, then. What by day was stolen. visit here. I have to be. As second counselor, the security of Raven Rock is my primary concern. This isn't exactly the city of Blacklight. We're on the frontier out here. And we've had more than a fair share of troubles. After all we've been through together, I refuse to let Councillor Morvain down. Councillor Morvain is House Redoran's representative on Solstein. As second counselor, it's my job to support him and make certain 
His rule is enforced. Ravenrock started out as an Imperial settlement. But the Empire decided to abandon it, just as my people were first setting foot here. They left the town a shambles. But when House Redoran took over, we turned it around and it became ours. And even if it's been a struggle to make this island livable, we're proud to call it home. Remember, we're watching you. I wasn't sure I'd make it off this farm alive. I wish I could have said the same for my man here. Some of the Redoran Guard have taken to calling them Ashspawn. Me, I don't care what they're called. All I know is they're a danger to Raven Rock and they need to be stopped. I was going to search for clues that might lead me to wherever they're coming from. I know it isn't the best place to start, but we know they've been coming from this direction. Good. I can use all the help I can get. Besides, I don't feel comfortable leaving Ravenrock behind. And I'd hate to lose any more Redoran Guard. We were searching the farm when the Ashspawn ambushed us. Have a look around and see if you can turn up anything useful. This is strange. The note says it's from General Falk's Carius. But that's impossible. Well... Carius was the Imperial Garrison Commander at Fort Frostmouth, but he died over 200 years ago when the Red Mountain leveled the place. There's no way he could still be alive. If General Carius is still alive, there must be something keeping him that way. I need you to head out to Fort Frostmouth and check it out. I'm gonna head back to Raven Rock and prepare the men for further assaults. Be careful, this General... Curious sounds out of his mind. What am I going to do? With me? What's the matter with you? Sorry, I've just had a lot of hawk-faced cowards coming by to mock my efforts. 
Uh, it probably can't hurt to tell you. You look mostly honest. The name's Rallis. Rallis Sedaris, out of Morhold. I've got a financier waiting for me back on the mainland. Sent me here in the interests of obtaining some rare antiquities. The relics of Arzador. But this whole thing became a disaster right quick, let me tell you. You come out of the Northern Ashlands, you don't expect things to go easy, you know. But this was something outside my particular expertise. When I first got to Colbjorn, you couldn't even see it. Buried in the ash, like most other things on this blasted island. I dug out a pile of the stuff taller than me just to find the barrel. Who knows how much to reach the door. Excavating isn't exactly my specialty. Even if it was, the ash storms fill it in faster than you can think. You think I've got that kind of money? No, I only get paid on delivery. Can't afford to go out of pocket for a thousand septums on this. Takes money to make money, all that rot. There's a lot of it at the other end. But I can't get there without a little kick to start it off. What? Are you... Are you serious? Well, I think I could make that work. We can sort out the details of our little arrangement later. But for now, I'll manage the dig if you can manage the coin. Do you have the gold? Mm. It's all here. Well then. Looks like I have a good bit of work to start on. I'll head back to Raven Rock and I'll help some diggers. Once we've got something worth looking at, I'll send word to you. Pleasure doing business with you, partner. I'll see you soon.
far from ourselves. He grows ever near to us. Our eyes once were blinded. Now through him do we see. Our hands once were idle. Now through them does he see. And when the world shall see. And when the world remembers. We must leave this place. You there. What brings you to this place? Why are you here? I am Freya of the Scar. I am here to either save my people, or avenge them. I am unsure. Something has taken control of most of the people of Solstein. It makes them forget themselves, and work on these horrible creations that corrupt the stones, the very land itself. My father Storm, our shaman, says Mirak has returned to Solstein, but that is impossible. Then you and I both have reason to see what lies beneath us. Let us go. There is nothing more I can do here. The tree stone and my friends are beyond my help for now. We need to find a way into the temple below. Isra! I'm here to help you! You must I'll believe this 